back, B. Welcome back to it. What the fuck is this? Girl, just where you been? Yes, you. Where you been? Oh, you're asking me where I've been? Because this is my channel and you came to watch me and I haven't posted in a while. So you wanna know where I've been? I guess you're right. Well, since you're here, welcome to It's Shireen's Peace. First of all, let's get into this motherfucking outfit. It's the simplicity for me. So I got this outfit from, um, actually I don't know where the jeans came from, but the sweater, shirt, whatever came from the thrift store. Yes, it came from the thrift store, Goodwill to be exact. So let's get right into it. Um, where have I been? Um, it's been about 10 months since I last posted. I think it was a hair video uh, that it was an epic fail. I flat out of my hair. Um, but go check that out. But yeah, it's been 10 months and also been 10 months since my father has passed away and made that transition. Um, I think I am just now coming to accept the fact that he's gone he had a birthday back in february uh first so i couldn't call him um uh, you know i even tried calling the number of course it's off um and i have a voicemail that he sent from the year prior um and i'll probably in hey baby how you doing this is your daddy I'm just hollering to see how you was doing. Holler at you later. Put that right here uh, for you guys to hear, but it's very real. It's very real. You know, you can't touch them. You can't talk to them. Um, you can't see them. You nothing. You know, he, he's he's gone. Um, and for me that is very real i think that that is probably the realest moment that has happened in my life that kind of sent everything like or put everything in perspective like it was it was definitely a reality check and i feel like a lot of things have have changed internally for me you know things that I thought I wanted before I really don't want anymore I, I can't see myself in that position anymore I'm just very grateful for my my family and my friends that continue to check on me um, you know because we all have our own lives going on no matter what happens you know at the end of the day we all have our own lives going on so for them to take time out of their day to just check on me it means the world to me and I, I i thank you guys from the bottom of my heart really and you know it's a lot of things that hold us back as individuals um it could be anything because we all have our own preferences you know we've all had our own experiences and I think that shapes us into who we are, you know, negatively or positively. Um, so for me, when something major happens, I shut down. And, you know, I want to dig deeper into myself. You know, why am I feeling this way? How am I going to move forward? And, you know, who do I want to become after this? You know? Um, who, who am I going to become when all of this is said and done, you know? And I made sure 
not to lose myself, you know? So that's why I, I shut down because I don't want to lose myself. So I want to continue learning myself, you know, and really living in that moment, you know, no matter how detrimental it is, you know, I need to feel that emotion. I, I need to feel that and unpack that, you know, emotion, emotions and don't just let them sit there. You know, I may not talk to people, but I talk. But I talk. <laughs> so that could be, you know, basically to myself sometimes. You know, me staring in the mirror and being like, hey, you got this, okay? Get your ass up. And, you know, everything is going to be okay. You know, I, I give myself a lot of self-talk. Self motivating talk, self prep, pet, self pet talks. Um, and, you know, it, it helps me. That's my, my, that's my therapy. You know, even, you know, getting in front of this camera and expressing it, it's therapeutic to me. And that's the whole reason why I started YouTube in the first place, anyway, is to express myself, have a platform to express myself you know no matter if I get one view or a million views it doesn't matter to me because it's really for me at the end of the day you know um because it's something that I want to do and it's just it allows me to tap into my creativity and that makes me you know get my head get out of my head you know for the most part so that's why we're here. We're back. Um, I'm better. And again, I thank everybody who has checked on me and we're we're doing nothing but moving forward to be or continuing to be our best selves, um, continue to learn ourselves, to continue to reinventing ourselves. And I think that's something that I will always do is reinvent myself, you know, because after everything happens, I learn something new. You know, I experience something new. So I take away from it what I do and, you know, you know. <laughs> um, so yes, we're moving forward. Um, expect a lot of new videos, hair tutorials, makeup. Um, I am definitely gonna have more, you know, discussions about things you know this page it's Cherise peace is all about peace so that that's i know i'm rambling but that's another reason why i shut down because you know my name is on here is it's Cherise peace you know Cherise is my real name my my middle name um and then of course peace so of course when that happened it's like i don't i don't feel like being peaceful i don't feel like i want to know like why did he have to leave me you know but in all seriousness um in realness you know life happens you know everybody is gonna have their expiration date and that's something that he used to always tell me and that makes it a little bit easier you know and then of course he was sick so he's not suffering anymore so that makes the the wound a little less painful um but of course i want my dad here with me you know i wish he had the time and the willpower the strength to get better but he's always here with me but yeah so expect nothing but positivity going forward um i want everybody to just continue to be themselves no matter what you're going through no matter what has happened to you in life just keep going by all means take the necessary time that you need to heal to to find yourself to fully register what is going on and how serious the severity of the situation is um but keep going nonetheless you know keep learning yourself keep reinventing yourself
All right, guys, so I'm just going to show you a couple of events that I enjoyed last year. Um, so it was actually my first time in Vegas. I went with my mom and my sister, um, and it was very interesting <laughs> because we have three totally different personalities, but nonetheless, it was a good time. I always enjoy going to the West Coast um, and just being around people after COVID for the first time. Um, it was it was really good um, this next slide or a couple of pictures is um, I was a part of a wedding so this is the bachelorette and um, the actual wedding um, that I was a part of and I would definitely do that again with these beautiful ladies it was such a beautiful experience um, but yes we are back thank you all so much for watching of course like comment and subscribe and I will see you all next week bye